Hello, everyone. I pray that you are doing well. I pray that God is blessing you. I pray that your day is doing very good. I honestly do. When you pray for something, let's say you want something very badly and it is not against God's rules. So you are praying for something that isn't a sin. Some things may happen in your life that may discourage you from believing or still wanting what you have prayed for. For instance, let's say that you are praying for someone. Let's say you are praying for someone. And let's say, like, there is a big problem between you and that person. A real big problem. So, because of the big problem, you may be like, I don't care. I am not going to pray for that person. That person can kick rocks. You know, like you may feel discouraged or yeah, you may feel discouraged to continue praying for that person and you may stop believing for whatever you are praying for that person, if that makes any sense to you. And I am here to say, just because you may feel a certain way today doesn't mean you are going to feel that way tomorrow or later on. I believe we can pray for something day after day after day after day after day. I believe we can pray for something for that long. And I believe the devil, yes, I believe demons can come in to discourage us from praying further on for a person. I hope this is making sense. In Ephesians chapter 6, verse 12, in essence, I believe it is saying that our fight is with the demonic so if we keep that in mind no matter how a person acts i would say it is probably wise to continue on praying for that person believing that god is going to answer or has already answered our prayers because faith is now. So when you pray for something, believe it is already done now. Is this making sense to you? I believe demons will try so many things I believe they are allowed to do particular things within a certain range, I believe. I guess, depending on 
our spiritual maturity but i don't have evidence of that but i believe demons can do certain things to us within a certain range so keep on believing when you pray for someone don't let issues discourage you from continuing to pray for a person because who knows who knows maybe maybe the demons know that if you continue on doing what you are doing maybe they know that you will get a breakthrough and receive what you are praying for maybe they are trying to discourage you or yes i believe maybe they are trying to discourage your faith discourage you from praying maybe that is one of the reasons why so many problems may be happening between you and the person you are praying for i can say this if you stay encouraged yes you may recognize the problems and stuff like that but stay encouraged keep on believing not letting anything to sway your faith and believing in what you are praying for, I believe you will get what you are praying for. Also, try to live a righteous lifestyle too. I think that is very important. I believe demons are here to sway our thinking, to get us to stop believing or to give up on it. I truly believe so. I truly believe that demons are trying to get us to stop believing, to give up on our prayers. In a sense, I would say to discourage us. I would say that. So, I believe you have to be the type of person who will keep on believing, keep on praying, whether you see good, whether you see bad, to keep on praying and have faith in Jesus Christ that he is going to work things out. Of course, do your part, but... I believe as humans, we can only do so much. And I believe the other part will have to be fought in a spiritual sense, which we may have to fast and do other things like that. So never stop believing. Don't become discouraged. If it be possible, don't become discouraged. Keep on doing what you have to do and don't let demons make you give up unbelieving in believing what you are praying for. When, whether you are praying for a person or not, I believe this goes for most things in general, I would say but the context of my message is pretty much about praying for someone i believe you can get what you are praying for if you stay steadfast like you are like hey this is what i want so i am going to pray i am going to fast i am going to be diligent and doing these things or more, not letting outside forces to get in my way, as in to discourage me. 
because I believe you can get what you want if you don't give up. And as long as what you are praying for is not a sin and also if you are trying to follow God's rules. Not saying we are going to be perfect at it, but have a heart to strive for perfection no matter no matter how many times you fail. So I don't want to beat a dead horse. <laughs> Let me stop here. God bless you.